your ratio needs at your fingertips. The Two Minute Ratio. Hello everyone and thank you for watching the 2 minute ratio. Today we're going to be talking about the 200 day moving average. So let's get started. The 200 day moving average is a trend watching strategy that helps to see the long term direction of a particular stock or even entire indices. So the first question you might be asking yourself is, why do we care? Well let's say you have two companies that you're looking to invest in. We're going to call them MyChair.com and MySeat.com. You want to figure out which company is trending upward so that you can buy that stock. MyChair.com has a stock price of $40.40 and MySeat.com has a stock price of $56.93. Is MySeat.com above the 200 day moving average? We don't know yet, not until we add the 200 day moving average to our stock price. The 200 day moving average is calculated by adding yesterday's close price plus the previous 199 trading days close price and dividing that total by 200. So let's take a look at MyChair.com first. The blue line on chart A is the stock price for MyChair.com and it currently is at $40.40. The red line represents the 200 day moving average for MyChair.com and it's currently at $45.48. This indicates that MyChair.com is currently below the 200 day moving average. Now let's take a look at MySeat.com on chart B. MySeat.com has a stock price of $56.93 and a 200 day moving average of $52.81. So it is currently above the 200 day moving average. MySeat.com is above the 200 day moving average and therefore the stock that is currently in consideration for purchase. This concludes the 200 day moving average video. Don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching. Two minute ratio.